Hi, welcome to Reptile Cam Pro. Uh, we all know that temperature has a lot of effects on leopard geckos. Uh, depending on the temperature you incubate the eggs at, um, 80 to 82 will give you all females, and uh, 89 to 90 will give you all males, basically. And that is set during the first 22 days of incubation, allowing you to move your uh, female eggs to uh, the warmer temps so that you get the prettiest pigments. Cool temps cause the, t the um, color pigments to become concentrated and darken uh, so that uh, if you incubate uh, at 80 degrees albinos all the offspring will look brown or lavender kind of chocolate like this animal. Also what a lot of people don't know is that uh, even after albinos hatch, if you get them around 27 Celsius or 80 to 82 degrees Fahrenheit, you will get darkening. And this animal is an example of that. It hatched beautiful and light colored, was incubated to be a female, moved to the higher temperatures after 22 days so that we get the pretty pink tangerine colors. But um, we had one rack uh, have a little heating failure during this winter and the geckos cooled off for over 24 hours around 74 degrees and so you get the darkening and this uh, can happen to anyone's geckos uh, cool shipment can affect uh, their color in the end what's nice is that after nine months of age uh, this phenomena stops and the color is locked in um, but one thing that's interesting, we had a gecko that looked great after nine months. He got out, lost his tail during the winter, and got exposed to cool temperatures. When the tail grew back, it was dark brown like this animal. The rest of the body was nice tangerine. So it's something interesting to study. Uh, leopard geckos have a lot going on. Temperature controls many things. Uh, and thanks for joining us today. Take care.